What's going on YouTube fam? It's your boy Tony Two Times and we back with another video. And I know I'm super late on this video, but I be busy and y'all know I don't care. I'm still gonna speak on it. And I'm gonna talk about that boy Bun B and the situation that happened when the little kid tried to break in his house. His wife was in the house. His wife answered the door thinking it was like Amazon or somebody. Somebody put a gun to her head, forced her back in the house. Bun B was actually on the toilet, you know what I mean, doing what he had to do and he heard the commotion and he came down and shots was fired and I'm pretty sure y'all seen the interview on the Breakfast Club but man it's crazy man like the thing about it they saying like Shorty was just a regular dude like when they went back and checked his Instagram posts and stuff like that he was actually from Arizona he was visiting with his mother who was in Texas you feel me he had a father in his life they said he was paying like motivational quotes and stuff like that online so they'll never think somebody like this would do something like that and they go to show you you don't never know what nobody thinking out here you think you know a person you feel me you don't know what demons people be having and you just gotta protect yourself I feel like Bun B did the right thing I don't advocate violence but if somebody come in your personal space and somebody try to harm your family or the people you love, you feel me? If you don't stand for nothing, you got to fall for anything. So you got to defend yourself, your honor, your family honor, your wife honor. Bun B actually went out there. She told the dude to take the car because she didn't want him to get upstairs and get the bun. But when he heard it was bun, he kind of got a little annoyed. But you feel me? Bun B actually went out there and he tried to, like, blame Shorty. And God must have been with Shorty because when they showed the car, it was like four bullets in the headrest. All that shorty got hit in the shoulder, and he ended up going to the hospital later and turned himself in or whatever. But, man, just, I mean, before you think about taking something from somebody, just think about how hard that person had to work for that. And if you ain't willing to die about that, you feel me, because people ain't going to play with you, you know what I mean? I hear a lot of stories where people get killed from breaking in people's houses. Like, people got the right to bad arms, so you got to be careful with that game. But, look, let me know what y'all think about this situation. Leave your comments below. If you're new to the family, be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell for uploads. Family, y'all already know what it is. We on that race to 10K. Be sure to share these videos. Check out the links in the description. Love, fam.